Hey guys, Streaming Iraq War Veteran here, and this is going to be a quick video of uh, the Allergy Retro Custom Duplication Glitch in its solo. And it's pretty easy to hit, there's barely any timing. And all that you require for this is a card that you don't care about losing, which I'm just duping over those because they're not that valuable. Um, so either the, those free cars, allergies, whatever, it don't matter. Just a car you don't care about losing, a car you want to duplicate that needs to be in your garage, which I just constantly use this one. Um, an MOC with personal vehicle storage. And uh, that's about it. But Alright, to start this one off, we're going to go outside. As you can see, you don't need custom plates either. Um... As you can see, they're all different plates. I'm only going to do three through this. I'm not going to go any longer. Oh, probably just two. For some reason, I can't connect to YouTube and stream, so I'll just do it this way. Now, the card that you don't mind losing needs to be in some other garage, not in your not in your uh, nightclub one where all of your cars that you want to dupe and stuff are. So basically, I'm going to grab me a street car. And mine, what I'm working on now, is over at Del Perro Heights. Sorry about the lawnmower. But it's at Del Perro Heights over here. Basically, I drive this car over here. And go in this the garage where they have the car that I don't mind losing. Let me do this real quick, guys. I don't have to hear him anymore. Or at least it's not as bad. Let's put it that way. Alright. Now, the one I don't care about losing is these, obviously. I'm just duping over these. And you can see it doesn't have a custom plate on it. Just bring this out. You, know, you just drive it a very little bit. I just drive it to the corner or whatever. Really little. Just away from the garage a little. You can get back in a random streetcar. <laughs> drive away until you can call the mechanic. I usually just drive to this end of my nightclub. And then you want to call for your... Oh, you need your Deluxo, by the way. You want to call your mechanic, get your Deluxo. You need something, huh? One of your rides? My Deluxo, the original Deluxo, is in my facility. I'll bring it to you. Now, this is going to look the same as the uh, Deluxo duplication glitch, because it basically is with a different with a different step that will duplicate the uh, the actual allergy. It's a little different. It's close to being the same, but it's a little different. Alright, you see this says my army vet one. Now at this point, you're still doing the same thing as the um, Deluxo glitch. You want to take this over to that wall breach behind Los Santos Customs over by the airport. And there's not going to be any jump scenes, so you know that this works. Alright. I'm not going to show you the place, because everybody should know where this is. You can tell on the map, to the mini-map to the left. Because I'm trying to do this as quickly as possible and do two of them for you guys here. You go in here right below the white brick and in that red uh, like dark black brick right here. Just like that. There's no death barrier so if anybody tells you to use a different one just don't. Alright. Go down until you hit the ground like I am now. Drive over 
to the false spot that you used before. And I'll explain how this is different after this step. Now basically you just fall and do what you did before. Either you can, as soon as you hit the barrier, hold the R2 or do it the other way. It seems to work a little bit quicker. Basically I'm right back here at the corner again where I told you before. I'm going to fall and then when the map turns, my mini map on the lower left turns black, I'm just going to hold, press and hold the R2, the gas button. So falling. Now I'm in the invisible barrier. I'm looking at my mini map waiting for it to turn black. Black R2. And I'm still holding R2. Now you can see my license plate changed. And at this point, this is where it's different. This is a duplicated car, but it's not stuck. You keep that in mind. It is not stuck at this point. Now the old one, you would take it into the back of your MOC. At this point, if you want to duplicate a LRG, you don't. Take this back to your nightclub, where your allergies are that you want to duplicate, because this car has not stuck yet. So, like I said, at this point, you're taking it over back over to your um, nightclub, which mine's uh, floor three, where I had all of those uh, deluxos and the allergies. Now the only little bit frustrating part is if you don't pay attention on this next section because you really actually need to pay attention to what you're doing here. It's not hard but you can forget very easily and I have a f better way of doing it that just makes it a little bit simpler. I'm not the founder of this by the way. I'm never a founder on any of my videos. I just pass them along to you guys. All right, I'm going into my nightclub, the floor fo uh, floor three, basement three, where I had all my stuff. You'll get the warning here that says it's full. Just accept it. You'll drive into your nightclub, and then you got to select a vehicle. Now, you have to remember which one you selected. I'm just going down the row, so it will be next to the last one down there you select that and you'll notice that it didn't change obviously they're both deluxos but still now what you do now is go to your blue circle and that was the one I selected I always use my first one here that's right behind my character and I switch it out with the one that I just dropped that other car and that hasn't stuck yet and when I switch it you'll notice that it will be an allergy retro but it's not stuck yet as you see it just duplicated to an allergy retro at this point you want to get in the original one which was this one but I'll show you that there's still the same car right there it says 592 and 592 Warning, never sell two cars with the same license plate. If you ever get the stick and you sell two cars with the same license plate, it will put you in a, uh, uh, a limited car selling thing for a long time. I think it's a year and a half. But you get back in the original car that you switched around, which for me is always going to be this one. And you can see it still has that 592 license plate drive out and at that point when you drive out your license plate will change see 439 from 582 now at this point to get it to stick because it's not stuck yet you call up your mobile operation center with personal vehicle storage ba -doop -doop -doop. and yes I might be a little bit louder but I'm pronouncing myself because of my neighbors running a uh, lawnmower. Now all you're doing at this point is just driving over to your MOC with personal vehicle storage and putting it in the back of there and that will get it to stick. And then you put it in your MOC 
and just accept the alert. You wait for the circle on the lower right hand corner to come up and then go away and then it's stuck. The game saved. And there it is and it's gone. Now you can just, what I've been doing is putting them back into my basement three. Now at this point I'm just putting it in there and this finishes up that part of my thing. <gasps> Now I will do it one more time for you guys and I'll tell you everything you need but step by step and all the requirements again. Now I'm putting this back where I got my original one. Boop. Now I only have two left. All right. Now we're back to start at this. What you need, requirements, is a car you want to duplicate in here, so an LRG RH8, uh, no, an LRG Retro Custom, excuse me, in one slot, and then free cars. I got two. I'm overwriting my Deluxe, so just pretend that they're LRG RH8s, the free cars. And then you need a car you don't care about in another garage, another free car. And then you need a regular deluxo doesn't matter it doesn't have to be customized or nothing uh, MOC with personal vehicle storage and if you got all that then you can start and the first step is to go where you have a car that you don't care about losing a free car I'm just writing writing over these cheaper luxo so that's what I'll be writing over So at this point, I just come. I walk out of my thing. I don't grab any personal vehicles or anything. I just want to take a street car because it makes the process easier. And then I go to the garage that has the vehicle I don't mind losing. Which for me right now I'm working on Del Perro Heights. So I just bring this car over here, I park it, go in and grab the car that you don't care about losing. And a session does not matter for this one either. Because I am in a public session this time. Alright, get in the car you don't mind losing. Drive it away from the door just a little bit. I usually just drive it over to here. Doesn't have to be far at all. Now, at this point, you get back in a streetcar. You drive far enough away until you can call your mechanic. However far you decide that will be for you. Me, I usually just do the same thing. And hit a tree on the way. No. <laughs> oh, took out a pole. But anywho, I just usually drive down here and stop in the back entrance to my nightclub. And I know that's plenty far enough. That's like way more than enough. But you call up your mechanic, call for your original Deluxo. My original Deluxo is in my facility, right there. Now at this point, you get in your Deluxo once it's delivered, and head to the wall breach at the airport. As you can see, it says Army Vet. But this is an easy glitch. If you can hit the other one, you should be able to hit this one. And I'm going over by that Los Santos Customs again. By that garage door, the metal garage door thing. And I'm going to go above it a little bit in between the metal garage door and the white brick. 
You basically want to fly into that black colored brick. Alright, at this point you just fly down, turn to the right, until you hit the floor, or what's the invisible floor level, and then dry, uh, fly over to the uh, drop point. And if you're having problems using the other guy's place, which I can never hit it there for some, some silly reason, the only place that I ever hit this glitch is where I'm doing it now. I can't use the spot that he was talking about. And this is my spot right here on the mini map. You just fall, and then when you hit a barrier, you wait for your map to turn invisible, or black, excuse me. You wait for it, you fall, you hit invisible barrier. And then when your mini map turns black, then you hold, press and hold R2 until you're fully out. Falling. Invisible barrier, waiting for the mini map to turn black. R2 and I'm continuing to hold R2 through this whole thing and as you can see it no longer says army vet At this point you drive the car to your nightclub where you have the allergies and stuff stored but forewarning to anybody I don't know how true it is or not but I guess the game can detect if you're selling a bunch of the same cars all at once. And I guess they're having a shit fit about it now. So if you're selling allergy retros and nothing else, sell two per day and that's it. I mean, if you can't live off of two million dollars a day, then that's pretty bad. Woo! I barely cleared that, didn't I? But all I'm doing at this point, like I said again, I'll just I'm just taking this over to my nightclub, the level three where those cars are that I want to duplicate, and then I'm in the process of doing. All right, back to my nightclub, basement three. Accept the alert. Replace over one of the cars that you don't mind losing. Now you'll notice it's still the same. Go to your blue circle. And I always switch it with a car that's right behind my guy so I know which one the original is. So you go back through and I switched it with this one. It will duplicate, but it's not stuck. Alright, at this point you want to go back in the original, which for me is always this one. That way I remember, because I've forgotten a few times. And it's 438, as you can see. When I get outside, it will change, but it's still not stuck. One seventy-five. At this point, you call up your MOC. And the reason I'm sitting at this angle is for some stupid reason. And that's the only way it will spawn at the closer spot if I'm looking at this angle for whatever damn reason. Now, once your MOC comes up, you'll just go in the back of it. And that's what will get it to stick. Put it in there, accept the alert. Wait for the circle in the lower right hand corner to go up and disappear, and then it's stuck. Game saved. There you go. And then I throw this back into my floor three. And that's basically it, guys. But the only other sh uh, thing you have to do with this is if you still have more cars to duplicate that you want to duplicate, they have to be in that garage or any garage in that in your nightclub you'll just have to move them around 
But alright guys, I am the Stream Iraq War Veteran. If you like this video, definitely give it a thumbs up. And if you're new to the channel, you can subscribe if you want to. It's always appreciated. And as always, I will see you in the next video.